Howard Phillips Lovecraft, and though I was not able to make it to the Necronomic Convention this year, luckily for me I had a friend on the scene, Leia Bond, who took it upon herself to gather some questions and interviews from various guests and attendees and even a few friends of the program. Let's go to Leah now. My Abdullah has read himself. It's his pocket change, even though pockets hadn't been invented yet. <laughs> now, the question is, the Umayyad Caliphate came to a sudden and abrupt and violent end right at precisely the time Abdullah Hazard was writing the Necronomicon about AD 750. Mm -hmm. My guess is, is it, is it true that um, Abdullah, had the, basically the last caliph of the Umayyad line, fell into darkness and was giving state sponsorship to the authorship, authorship of the Necronomicon. And the whole reason there was a revolution was precisely because the Orthodox found out about this and there was a sudden change of dynasty. It's too big a coincidence to be a coincidence, don't you think? Ah, Mr. Schweitzer, what a, what a truly well thought out theory. It, it's fascinating. It, it seems to all match up. Um, I hate to quibble, but there, there is the slight problem that uh, the, the mad Arab al Hazred uh, did have the slightest um, issue with, uh, how to put it, not existing. So um, I, I don't mean to, to trouble you, but you, you might want to look into that. Although, then again, when have mere facts ever gotten in the way of good history? As always, I'm Howard Phillips Lovecraft. Thank you.